Hello everyone, it's Allie from Titan and welcome back to our channel. I am here with another Star Wars Holocron personal break today. This box here is for Tom L. from Minnesota. So thank you so much Tom for letting me open up this box for you. I hope to find you some awesome cards to add to your Star Wars collection. Now we haven't seen a single sketch card today, so that would be an awesome find here. And like I said, every time I say it, it becomes more and more true because we have yet to find a printing plate in quite some time. I keep, I've been saying it all day today. I was saying it the other day when I was opening up Holocron, and we still haven't found one. So it gets more and more true. Still opening up boxes and not finding any printing plates. So I'd love to find one here for Tom. So let's go ahead and get on into it by snapping us into the corner. Now we have seen a very nice photo variation short print today out of a box we just opened up for Jaleel. We did find the Padme photo variation, which still has excellent value. So big congrats to Jaleel there. Now let's see what we can find here the other day for Jacob. We opened up Three short prints out of four boxes, so I mean, we could have another one here. Let's see what we can find by getting on in to pack number one. Now, Holocron, this product does guarantee one autograph per box. Sketches are additional hits, printing plates are additional hits. As long as it's not an autograph printing plate, that will count as your auto. We're starting off here, though, with an orange parallel R2-D2, number 72 of 99. Let's go ahead and get that sleeved up. Sleeve one open there for a minute. I was like, what's going on? All right, and next pack here. But yes, there are a lot of different parallels to be found in this product. You have the regular base cards and you have your green parallels. Next up, you have the foil parallel. Then it jumps to the oranges out of 99, purple out of 10, blacks out of 5, and red one of ones. We have yet to see out of all the cases that we've opened any red one of ones. Um, we have seen a, a decent amount of plates, but they've been a bit dry recently. That is why I keep keep talking about the plates. I mean, I am a big person. I'm personally a big printing plate collector, so I love opening up plates. I love seeing them. I love collecting them myself. So that's really what I'm hunting here, because this product has been pretty good about yielding plates. Even during our live breaks this past weekend, did see two autograph printing plates. But for our regular our regular personal breaks, we haven't seen. I don't think any. So I'd love to find some here. Spread the plate love. Just at least a little bit. But I've actually acquired one, two, three plates from this. Wait. One, two, three, four plates. I keep forget I keep forgetting that rose plate that I pulled during the live stream, because I do have that one. It's in my little queue pile for Boss Man to check me out at one point. Um, I have acquired four printing plates from this product already. I mean I am hunting way too many of them for my personal collection. Oh, we already have our autograph here. But we have Jesse Jansen SAC Tin from Revenge of the Sith. That is number 230 out of 404. That is our autograph of the box. But I absolutely love plates. So it'd be very great to find one here so I can uh, be talking about something relevant in the video. Please, box, give us a plate. Please. I'm begging. Please give... Can I have plates, please? But alrighty, next pack here. Got two greens and a Mace Windu lightsaber insert. Alright, so what do we have here? We have green and a foil. Full Yoda, that's pretty cool. More lightsaber insert. Still only the one orange parallel, so we should be getting another numbered card here. Or a sketch or a short print does seem most of the time. You get one orange and then something additional. On occasion we have had an orange, something additional, and another orange. Usually it is either just two oranges or one orange and something else. Whether that be purple, sketch, short print, or otherwise. All right, getting close to the end here, down to just one last row in this box for Tom. And we do have a sketch. This is also by Shane McCormick. Now, Jacob did get a Shane McCormick sketch of Princess Leia the other day. That was a gorgeous sketch. I'm very excited to check this one out. It is, it is one of the Cantina. I'm not sure what they're called, but I know there's actually quite a few collectors of them out there. Because people really like the Cantina aliens. But that is an incredibly detailed sketch. It reminds me of the Doctor Who the Ood. Uh, if they just didn't have the uh, the things hanging down from their chin, just the head shape and whatnot. Uh, but that is actually an incredibly detailed sketch. I'm impressed about how much I like it for not being an alien fan or alien collector. That is a bonus hit here. Sketch, Cantina Alien 
for Tom. Tom, I hope you love the Cantina Aliens. If not, I know there's a lot of Shane McCormick sketch collectors in general. Maybe able to trade for something else. That is pretty cool. So we do have a sketch here. Might be having just that sole R2-D2. Let's continue. Foil Grief Karga. Have a foil clone troopers phase one. And the last pack here of this box for Tom. Looks like that sketch in the one orange will do it here. So let me go ahead, move this box out of the way so we can do a quick recap here. Let's take another look at that sketch here by Shane McCormick. Lots of color. Creepily realistic, if I do say so myself, on the, this part of the alien. He just wants to play his music and I'm unfairly judging him. I'll just set him down. And we have this Jesse Jansen autograph, a sassy tin, number 230 out of 404. And our one orange of the box, R2-D2, number 72 of 99, Rebellion number 7. Because, of course, there's the different numbering here. It's a 200-card set, but it's not numbered 1 through 200. And there's a bunch of different R2-D2s. Like, I'm pretty sure there's a Republic R2-D2. Uh, there's probably a lot more R2-D2s. I've seen a lot. I'm not certain what the uh, actual numbering is there, but I, I've seen a prequel R2-D2, so I know there's a Republic R2-D2. But that will do it here for this box for Tom. Thank you so much, Tom, for letting me open this on up for you. Hope you enjoyed the opening and love these new additions to your collection. All of you guys out there watching as well, of course, I hope you enjoyed it too. If you did, make sure you go ahead and hit that like button. Any comments from you, leave those down below. And if you're not yet part of the Titan Cards family, we'd love to have you with us. Make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Now, of course, before I wrap off the video completely here, do have to give an extra shout out to all of our channel members. Thank you so much, you guys, for going above and beyond. Do have the Black Label fans, Andin, Bounty Hunter Breaks, Pooh Bear, and Stephen Olivo. To all of our Gem Mint fans, we do have Anthony Basileo, Devon, uh, Dusty Archuleta, Geriatric Geek, House Style 13, Jake Ryan OC, and Michael C. I feel like I either get the bottom half of the list memorize or the top half but i promise i'll keep working on that you guys but thank you so much all of you channel members for going above and beyond with your support of the channel and to all of you viewers as well of course i still appreciate each and every one of you without you guys the channel wouldn't be successful so i thank you guys very much but i'll do it for this opening up next we do have a ufc striking signatures box for yvonne I'm curious to see what that one will be that'll be a very quick opening as well so make sure you stay tuned for that it'll go by in the blink of an eye i almost snapped there and i was like if i feel like if i have to snap i have to change all right all right, there we go. Did it. I'm switching up on you guys. Bet you all didn't expect this. But anyways, that'll do it for this video here. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. Take care, stay safe, and I'll catch you very soon in that next video. Bye.